Hello guys, this is Lucas Drummer. Today I'm going to show you how to make your Axis Universal Drive Shaft nice and tight again. Check this out. In this process you're going to require a pair of Allen wrenches. So this small one goes right in there. The larger one fits in there. A timer. A watermelon. Just kidding. <laughs> a pair of forceps. It's not necessary, but maybe you're gonna need them, so it's good to keep them handy. And a pair of gloves. Thermal resistant gloves are welcome. We're going to deal with some high temperatures. Of course, you're gonna need your universal drive shaft and a baking oven. All right, let's have it done. Let's have a look at this drive shaft. This one has got a lot of clunk. It's not tight at all, which is a guarantee that we're not gonna have a good time while using it on our double paddle. Uh, the thing we're gonna do, we need to tighten all of these Allen screws that are sitting around the main bearing. At the same time, we're gonna tighten these, all right, holding the U joints and attaching them to the rods on both sides. And to have it done, we need to melt the Loctite that Axis guys use on every single screw on their paddle. To melt the Loctite, we have to set up our oven on about 180 degrees Celsius, 175-180, which is 340 degrees Fahrenheit, and preheat it. The main principle of the baking method is to heat up and melt the Loctite that Axis applies on all the screws on the paddle. It melts in about 340 degrees Fahrenheit, heating time 5 minutes. And you have to be pretty quick, and uh, use your protective gloves. This one is gonna get very very hot, so there is a risk for getting burnt, so that's why you gotta use the gloves. And be fast, you know. Because once the Loctite hardens, it's very difficult to adjust and tighten. So now I can see the oven is uh, ready to go. So let us open it and put the drive shaft inside. Ta -da! All right. Set the timer on five minutes and just let it go. Alrighty, let's have a look at the drive shaft. Yeah, it's in there. Gotta take it out. And, um, oh, the, the melting Loctite smells pretty bad, so put on the fan, you know. Gloves on. What are we gonna do next? We grab our uh, Allen wrench and we tighten up all those Allen screws around the main bearing. Look. Take it like that. one round at a time. Not too tight. And 
be quick and you know, it's uh, goddamn hot. That. More. Take the other side. Slowly eliminating the clunk. This side seems like it's okay. Alright. Still a little bit of uh, tightening here and there. Nice and tight. So still, we have this little bastard here. Right. Tighten that up. Nice and snug. And the other one. There you go. Okay, so you're gonna do now. Just let your uh, universal drive shaft rest and uh, cool down for a while, and then you're good to go. So thank you very much for watching. This was uh, Lucas Drummer. See you next time. <laughs>